Well, it is only the second game in the group phase, but already this is crunch time for some, certainly those who have suffered defeat in their opening game. The prospect of an early exit already hangs above their heads. The players and managers have to put a brave face on it with the pre-match press conference, but that is not going to change the overwhelming truth here. That is that they really must seek to avoid defeat. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. The crowd rises for the national anthem of Germany. Some performance and now here comes the response Some in the media have dubbed this already a desperation derby. Well, it doesn't have to be doom and gloom simply because you've lost one game. That can be rescued quite quickly here uh, with a great chance of, of turning fortunes round and lifting spirits and just creating much more optimism. And they can still emerge from this group. Their hopes and dreams are very much alive from the way I see it. There's the whistle, and here we go. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? I'm going to pick João Moutinho. I call him the ferret because he can slip into places and cause trouble before opponents can react. Loves to get between the lines and, and then get... Mario Rui has got himself a free kick. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Henricks tries to locate someone up front, and it's Sané. Tony Kroos, Sané. Cleared without complication. Kroos, now it's Sané. Defending of the desperate variety. And the counter is on. Bernardo's... Bernardo Silva! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. It's been taken short. Ronaldo. Towering header! Oh, not the best of headers.
Jao Moutinho. Tries to get it forward quickly. Bernardo Silva. Bruno Fernandes. And it's Bernardo Silva. Ricardo Pereira. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Defenders on the back foot. Just brushed off the ball there. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal-saving. Now it's Canabri. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Out to the left it goes. Back into the middle. Mario Rui has come steaming up from the back for this. Tony Kroos. He's made sure that that won't get through. And it's Mario Rui. Portugal cannot keep hold of the ball. Bernardo Silva. Portugal claiming a corner, and the referee concurs. In for a header! He will be livid with himself. Pepe, Germany so far providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. Ruben Diaz with the crossfield ball. Bruno Fernandes, Jean Moutinho, Bernardo Silva, Gnabry, and here's the chance to counter. And it's Tony Kroos. He's managed to get himself offside. Rui Patricio gets it upfield. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Shoots! Gnabry. Gnabry puts his foot on the gas. Werner. Now it's Sane. Good challenge, he just stood firm. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Schuller gets it back. Tony Kroos. Kimmich. Plays it out to the flank. And the shot! Goal! Germany! And Germany are in front! And you know, thinking about that, I think they've reflected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled.
1-0 lead established. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Werner. Sané. And here's Canabri. Shot a goal! It's in! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Oh, what a cracking goal! But a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. without reply well they're very much the better team at the moment Peter and, and no doubt will be looking to to cause even more damage here played out to the right oh good interception Sane and here's Canabri oh, Christian that's a foul Ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. No routine save. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. A real chance to break. Sane. Kimmich. And here's Sane. Ruben Diaz. Germany have scored two quick goals here and are firmly in the driving seat. 2-0 the score. And it's played forward. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Looking to break out here. Finds himself eased off the ball. And now they can launch a counter. Gnabry switches it towards the other side. Ruben Neves. Schuller. And there's the end of the first half. So first half thoughts. Germany just didn't want the half-time whistle to be blown. Convincing and controlled. Germany in control at half-time. 2-0. Things going for the second half. Ginter. And it's Sane. And here's Kroos. Oh, great ball. It's Werner. And more, and more, and more. And surely that settles it. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. 
Mario Rui. Bruno Fernandes. This is Ronaldo. Lings in across. Tony Kroos. Henriks. Bernardo Silva. Henriks looks to bypass the midfield. Ruben Diaz does well there, alert. Keeper sends it forward. And here's Canabri. Sané has a pop! And with the goal at his mercy, a dreadful miss. Germany just served up a reminder of how good they can be on the break. Their method is clear. Bruno Fernandes. And here's Andre Silva. Andre Silva! Great save, that was not easy. Portugal are really feeling the strain now. Impatience has taken charge. Sane plays it forward. It's Werner! It's off target and by quite a way. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. Timely intervention. Tries a shot! It's anyone, and they've been caught out here. For a corner. So here comes a substitution. Massive leap! No, he didn't quite meet it right. Ah, oh, good play all round. He was well hustled and, and still got a shot away. Looks to thread it through. Has he picked him out? Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Tony Kroos. Kroos goes looking. Drexler! In it goes! Players ecstatic. Fans delirious. This is utopia. That's wonderfully done. Chris Pitt, true finish. Drexler simply knew the ball was asking to be hit first time because of the way it arrived and boy did he hit it well it's an inspired substitution terrific move by the boss well the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal mission accomplished Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Germany tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Ruben Diaz battles to win it back. Keeper's got good distance on that. And here's Canabri. 
has a pop! No, no way through there. Now it's Canabry. Henricks. Talk about singling someone out. Yeah, and having notched a goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulder as, as much as he'll want. Henricks to play it forward. Ruben Neves. Out to the right. Werner looking to get on the end of this. It is a corner, good chance. Couldn't keep it down. <laughs> and here's Canabry. Brent. Good time. Has a goal! A terrific save. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. <laughs> A spectacular effort! And he's hit it too high. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. And it's Bernardo Silva. João Moutinho gets it out to the wing. Bernardo Silva. Bernardo goes for goal! comes to nothing. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Try something new. Rui Patricio sends that a long way. Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. to shoot! Brent. Werner. Andre Silva. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. That's surely a foul free kick. And he's going to have his name taken. That's alert and sharp, and very well put. Got a shot away! Keeper always had the measure of that. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Clear. Oh, 
Bruno Fernandes. Portugal have a free kick. Towards the flank. That's a great show, Moutinho! Yeah, the best in the keeper. <laughs> Bruno Fernandes with the short one. Puts in a cross. And out it comes again. Drexler, who has made his impact already. Werner. Gnabry. Cut out in the nick of time. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Guerrero goes up and over. He's got away. It's a brilliant interception. Rüdiger drives it forward. Forward it goes. Werner. Draxler. Now it's Gnabry. Gnabry. He's got he just whacks it away. Oh, shooting chance! Oh, take it with style! A contest no more. It is nothing short of utter humiliation. Well, I wasn't expecting them to go this big, Peter, but they have been superb. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Every single time he's been in possession, he's looked a threat. Portugal are making a change now. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. And that's it. Germany enjoy their perfect day. For their victims, it is entirely imperfect. Comprehensive winners of a one-sided contest. Well, they've done what they needed to here. They have bounced back from defeat on day one. It is a win that keeps them bang in contention. Your reflections then, Jim. Germany can certainly give themselves a pat on the back for a job well done. They have a togetherness that makes them very hard to beat.